there are seven levels of VR realism. I'm about to go through all the levels with level seven literally looking like real life. I'm talking graphics, mostly just graphics. Yep. Starting from level one. This is Rec Room. I haven't been on here in literal years. The legs is new. I would say Rec Room is number one as the graphics are just not there. It is a fun game though. Dang, dude. Okay, maybe I suck. Fudge. Ah, oh, dang it, dude. Okay, I'm very bad at the game. Let's just move on to level two. This is Job Simulator. A little more realistic than Rec Room, but still pretty cartoonish. Turn on the grill, brother. Chicken in there. Why not? Burnt bacon. Some tomatoes. Oh, dang it. Oh, 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 uh, oh, no, no. I just served my customer two burnt pieces of toast and an empty cup. I think it's time to move on. This is Population One. Yo, what's up, bro? Mask the beast. Damn, look at what this guy gave me, bro. Dang, this guy's crazy, bro. Dang. Well, we lost. Uh, cool montage, but didn't matter. Let's move on to level four. Hello? Can anyone hear me? This is Green Hill. I joined the server. For some reason, the recording did not pick them up. But Green Hill is basically the peak of when graphics start to get better. Yo! It was getting dark and they were leading me to their camp. Riverman99, I'll follow you. Bro, I can't see Jack. It's so damn dark in here. Hey, guys. <laughs> You know, I was having fun playing the music until they took it away from me. <sighs> no! No, not the drum! I left the game after he did this. Level 5 is when we take it up a notch and we play one of the most graphical games there are on standalone VR. Oh, dang. It looks fantastic. I'm not even gonna lie. Underwater. Don't worry about any environment. This is hubris talked about a lot when it first came out mainly because of its graphics and although beautiful the gameplay Well, it's a mixed bag oh, This is sick. Ooh, dude. Wait, what happened to the planets? This is beautiful so realistic But what was more realistic is the next game which I think takes it up even higher than hubris Some might say that hubris has better graphics, but honestly debatable This is Red Matter 2. I think out of actual games, it has the best graphics. Not only that, it also has a cool campaign. So graphics plus gameplay, it's a nice bag. This game has probably been talked about in all videos when it comes to standalone graphics. I'm burning up in here. What the heck? This game looks hecka good. Dang. What planet is this? Analyzing data drive. Data uploaded. Scan again. Let's fly. Ooh. Man, the rocks look so good. Everything looks so good. Let's see how this looks, though. Oh, man. I can't wait to look at this. Oh, it's so beautiful, bro. Holy, man. Look at this rock. It looks so rocky. Look at this ground. It looks so wet. Snow. It looks so snowy. Dang. Let me look at this wall. Look at that texture. I think it's time to even go up a notch. Let's see what's next. Red Matter 2 is awesome when you want actual gameplay with the bugs graphics, but level seven is you can't really get more real than this. This is it. This is basically kind of almost reality. And I urge you to try it out because it is free. All right, the next one is going to be in my kitchen. Just kidding. Did I get you there? Haha. <laughs> this is Hyperscape and in his rooms scanned using, I think, your Quest 3 three cameras in the front and i think it's crazy technology which by the way you can also download and try it out yourself and scan your room your own room and it will look basically like this this is gordon ramsay's house and i can actually teleport around and look at his shirt i guess this is by far the most realistic graphical wise experience you can get on the standalone i mean seriously look at this dang I want that watermelon. This is awesome. Th I, I don't know what else to say. This is next level. This is the future. Sooner or later, I'm going to be shooting aliens in Gordon Ramsay's kitchen with like a 120 hertz uh, 8K 
and all that stuff. This is the future. Now, the video is over here, and this was level 7, but I do want to give some honorable mentions. Firstly, Batman Arkham Shadow. Not only was it fun, but graphical-wise, it looked great. Now, even games like The Climb 2 or Bone Lab should be mentioned. I hope you all enjoyed this video. If you did, please be sure to like, subscribe, and don't forget that Jesus loves you. He died for your sins and mine. And I'll see you all next time. Deuces.